Uh, dear parents, School of Modern Schools is presenting this tutorial to help you access your, the student's account, your, your son's account or daughter's accounts in Think Central. So first of all, in Google, just we write Think Central. Here we go, Think Central, www dash k 6 thinkcentralcom press on it. It'll ask you to put the country or select United Arab Emirates and the school we have to select School of Modern Skills. And after that you have to provide the username and password that's given to your your son or daughter. Or it's attached, usually we'll attach it. The teachers are going to attach it in the paradigm. I'll give an example of a assignment that's given to a student in grade two. So his account starts with SMS dot one eight four six. Then a student also will be provided with a passport. So when just we press login with we'll access will will access to this dashboard in which we have my library, my scores, things to do. We'll start with my library. In my library here are the available books. So your son or daughter, there is no need for them to carry the books from class to home or vice versa. You can just check any book online. Take for example the science. Here we go, electronic students edition. Mathematics. We have all the books and even animated math models and many other stuff. We go back to the main dashboards. As we can see, if we press things to do, we'll find that this class, there are in this class there are many assignments. So show assignments, test only, or show all assignments. For example, here beginning of the year. So this means the student is assigned a mathematic assignment, two assignments, in fact, one science. So all the assignment, let's check if there's any, nothing at all. So again, things to do. Let's say he's assigned this assignment, how to do it, press begin. Okay, beginning of the year, just to press it in front of the student. There will be displayed another screen in which <clears throat> there are first some instruction of how to use the how to make the test in fact click next to go to the next question and so on and so forth I'll start the test so pressing start the test you'll be given the questions you can press play in order to listen have your teacher print this item for you okay to listen to the instruction there are five trucks three trucks are blue the rest are red. Which number sentence can you use to find the number of red trucks? So as you can see here, even the question is read for the student. He must just select the correct answer and press next to move to the next question and so on and so forth. In case the question is too long, like 40 questions, he can pause, take a rest and so on and so forth. And when he finishes, he will have a bottom here instead of next end. Now I'll quit the test. That's all for today for this tutorial. I hope that this will be useful and you'll have an easygoing test in the future. Thank you.